Right, so for those of you wanting bigger iPads, I might have some good news because BOE is allegedly manufacturing 15 inch iPads in the very near future. So let's delve into this report, but first make sure to like and subscribe for the latest Apple news and rumors. And with that being said, let's just talk in. Right, so this report's coming from the Korean website, The Elec. These guys are supply chain experts. And so yeah, this information is pretty legit in my opinion. So what exactly do they tell us? Well, they believe BOE's converted one of their factories in China to manufacture larger OLED displays for future iPads. Now this would corroborate with a report from Mark Gurman a few months ago stating that engineers were developing larger iPads internally. And so this could be our first piece of evidence that Apple's actually going ahead with this plan. Now, of course, some of you guys might be wondering, are we gonna see the size increase with the 2022 models? Well, I don't think so because Mark Gurman has said, we should see the 2022 iPad Pros come in the current screen sizes. And of course, do note the report does state this is going to be a 15 inch OLED panel and of course Apple's not going to give us OLED on the iPad this soon. I do think mini LED is going to stay for a few more years and then of course we see the transition to OLED. And for those wondering why Apple's switching to OLED, do remember these are two stack structure OLED displays and so that means they have two layers of red, green, and blue emission layers, which allows for two times the brightness, and I think four times the durability over mini LED. So yeah, this is gonna be a major display upgrade, and I'm pretty excited to see larger iPads. Since I do know many who use the iPads as a laptop replacement, and so of course having the extra real estate is gonna be very much appreciated. Also for designers and artists who use the iPads, having a bigger canvas is again gonna be pretty nice. And yes, I know some of you guys might be concerned about the weight, but do remember that many do leave their iPads in the Magic Keyboard case. They rarely carry it around by itself. And so I do think for those using the iPads as a laptop replacement, I do think the larger screen is gonna be a pretty neat upgrade. Also, I do think Apple's kinda run out of things to give us on the iPads, since of course, the hardware is near perfect now, and it's up to the software team to give us pro apps and actual pro and features to take advantage of all this power in this iPad. But till then, yes, to expect these hardware changes that I'm sure is not gonna appeal to all iPad users. Now as to when we can expect this new larger iPad, I don't think it's gonna be anytime soon because the report does state that BOE is new to the two stack structure display tech and so they're very much testing waters and it might take them some time to commercialize the tech and produce it on the scale Apple needs. And so yes, much like Mark Gurman previously said, don't expect this larger iPad to launch anytime soon. Anyways guys, tell me in the comments below, would you buy a larger iPad Pro? Anyways, thank you for watching guys, make sure to like and subscribe for the latest Apple news and rumors. Check out the video in the cut above on details regarding the iPhone 14 series. And on that note, I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya peeps.